Today's horoscope and tarot reading from Astro Academy, Taurus March 27, 2022. The moon spends another day in your solar fourth house, and you're prioritizing your personal life and need for comfort and familiarity. Early today, it's best to avoid waiting for others to sense what you want or need. Decision-making can suffer, but it may be better to wait and see. As the day advances, it's easier to focus on strengthening yourself for future endeavors that are more adventurous or ambitious. In fact, transits this week point to a stronger sense of mission regarding your work, finances, talents, and practical affairs. You can be a leader and influencer. Transforming your reputation can figure strongly. Take a well-deserved day to yourself. After all, acts of self-love make you 10 times more attractive, so take as much time as you need to recharge your energy today, despite whether you're single or already romantically attached. If you're in deep introspection or perhaps more lethargic than usual, don't take it out on your lover. The moon will be glimmering through sentimental cancer and your fourth house of home, family matters, and innermost feelings, hence your need to retreat. However, the moon's connection to dreamy Neptune, via your twelfth house of closure, dreams, and all things behind the scenes, adds a layer of fantasy to the mix. As the week begins, you are called to intuitively reflect on your emotional investments and commitments regarding your profession. The moon radiates in her domicile of Cancer, which opposes Venus in Capricorn. The opposition highlights your private versus public life and home versus career. You may feel slightly emotional throughout the day, likely thinking about where you started and how far you have come since then. The opposition could even highlight your work-life balance, as you may realize how much you have devoted to one area over the other. Be gentle with yourself and focus on your successes. A week after a friendly aspect between Pluto on the career and the south node on the income front began it is still just as tight. This comes just as the moon is making a more fleeting friendly aspect to its partner the north node in your financial sector, creating a sense of confidence on both sides of the financial fence. Your advice is in great demand. Because of your high energy levels, you are happy to comply, but take care not to give too much of yourself. You might suffer a burnout and lose interest in others. It's fine to ask others to return the favor. Ultimately, relationships work best and give and take are done in equal measure. It's a good time to go out on your own and deal with your issues. Other folks, even close friends, will just ride your nerves until you snap. You should be able to get pretty far today, though it may take a bit more energy than you were planning to spend. As soon as you arrive on the scene you find that rivals seem to fade from view. Maintaining a natural approach helps you get the attention from any potential admirers. Make the most of your desirability and appeal, but be sure you don't overdo the swagger, any exaggerated conduct can quickly become a turn-off. You are well acquainted with today's energy and you are going to get a big enormous extra helping of it with today's planetary alignment. It's important to drink a lot of water and exercise regularly, to both soothe and process this fiery energy. The benefit will be apparent to others, and you can expect to hear a lot of compliments on your radiant skin, your upbeat mood and your overall exuberance. The time to knuckle down and get some work done is at hand. In fact, you'll probably notice that you can't think of anything else but what you need to do. This is part of this day's magic. Your concentration and stamina will be strong, and handling challenges will seem much easier than usual. Even if you have made other plans, consider changing things around so you can take full advantage of the day's energy to get things done. That the moon just happens to be moving through your home and family sector as you move into some of the most exciting and defining three weeks of this professional year is a timely work and life balance reminder. The moon will be gone by tomorrow so this is not something ongoing and instead, in Mercury's last full day in your career sector this is a chance to use his intellectually savvy edge to work smarter. With Venus and Mars aligned here for the next three weeks, this also makes it easier to keep an open mind. As the moon clashes with yet more planets in your career sector, 
This continues to push any work and life balance issues to the surface, and the timing couldn't be better. Not only will the moon be in your romantic sector by tomorrow, but to begin the lead up to the most romantically charged full moon of 2022. With the moon only here for a few days, these are the right reminders, at the right time. Your tarot reading for today. Justice, the lovers, and temperance. The cards show that you have been going too fast in a romantic relationship in the last few weeks. You're spreading yourself too thin and you have trouble organizing your desires and making good choices. For a long time you haven't been making good decisions because of a lack of perspective on the situation. You have strong feelings for someone and have had them for some time. However, the way you manage your relationship with this person is not good, you are unable to be completely fulfilled with him because you act with too much impulse and not enough thought. The advice given by the cards is to slow down, to live each day as it comes, so you can see things coming. This will let you trace a path more in line with your needs, leaving things more time. This is one of the keys to a successful relationship, don't push things too hard. If one person or the other wants to go too fast, it could ruin everything, and we all know it would be a shame to ruin a strong and unique connection. Remember to be yourself in this relationship, regularly take stock of your needs and expectations, and of the evolution of this relationship, which is not really what you could call a couple at the moment. What does the future hold? The future depends on the history, and the cards aren't saying any more for now, it's up to you. Our eyes in the sky. Our hearts and minds are open this morning as the Capricorn moon forms a helpful aspect to joyous Jupiter. You could be eager to connect on an intellectual and emotional level, but if those around you aren't able to keep up conversationally, you might need to look for ways to expand your social circle. Watch out for negative influences throughout the morning as Luna and Pluto engage in a harsh aspect. These vibes can bring out controlling or possessive behavior, so keep an eye out for such actions in you and others. Luckily, when the Moon and communicative Mercury form a cosmic alliance this afternoon, you should be able to talk through any issues that arise. Diplomacy will go a long way right now, so be sure you're giving others the space to truly be heard. Fences should be fully mended by the time the Moon and Venus share a soft connection in the cosmos this afternoon. This energy is perfect for celebrating love in all its forms, so look for ways to connect with your nearest and dearest.